Hi, this is Jim Whitley from the world famous tool shed located at 1073 Main Street in Worcester. Hours this week are Wednesday through Saturday, 1 to 5. We can be found on the web at www.use-tools.com. Let's take a look at some of the stuff we have this week. Bargain tables loaded up at two bucks. We have a Craftsman variable speed wood lathe. This is $325. We have a set of uh, Sorby uh, hollowing tools. That's $55 for the set. There's a bunch of Sheffield England. Um, there's no name on them, but they do say Sheffield England on them. Um, turning tools and maybe some type of gouge. Uh, they range in price from $5 up to, this one here is $20. This one has the little doohickey end on it. I don't know if you can see that very well. They do have another set of turning tools here. Um, and I did not put a price on this. So I need to do that. I don't think there's anything special about them. They're probably craftsman grade or uh, these ones might even be below craftsman grade. So uh, don't have a price on that yet. Dremel. Scroll saw is $70. The stand is $25. There is a nut set somewhere. I don't know where I put it. I think it's in the next thing I'm going to show you. All right, so the snap-on three-quarter inch drive set with the ratcheting attachment, the adapters up and down from half to three-quarter, and, and then the breaker bar attachment, and then the snap-on uh, T-handle. That is $220. Still have a few large wrenches, two inch and three quarter, inch and seven eighths. Uh, let's go over here, jointer. Jointer is $150, delta six inch. Uh, could use a little cleaning. Uh, Parker Vice, 150. Craftsman bottom bo uh, middle box is 35. Craftsman top box is uh, 65. A four ton porta power is $60. Some propane tanks. $50 on the Ryobi chop saw. A uh, bunch of end mills still from last week and reamers. All right. Um, Stanley number four. Could use a good cleaning. 20 bucks. Six dollars on the hammer. Uh, $750 on the Husky half inch drive ratchet. Craftsman 38, $750. $11. i am sorry. This is an SK and it looks like $17.50 on the half inch breaker bar, $12.50 on the Craftsman breaker bar, $10 on the uh, double sided hammer. Snap on 3 8 breaker bar, $12.50. Snap on 3 8 $12.50. The quarter inch drive one is $10. A couple snap on uh, miscellaneous wrenches there, $5.50 on the powder actuated gun. A couple spreaders there, no price on those. Uh, some stones, those are $3 each. Dollar on the tape measure. Here's the nut set. I don't have a price on that. Boy, I don't have a lot of price on a lot, a lot of things, huh? $4 on the electrical tool. Some um, uh, tap handles and uh, die handles. Those are $4 each. $13.50 on the rigid tubing cutter. $9 on the hammer. The thread chaser is $7.50. Uh, snap on T handle. This is $8.50. Four dollars on the large um, or the long pliers channel lock seven dollars and fifty cents flex head craftsman uh, three eighths is thirteen dollars and fifty cents snap on with a broken piece here if you got a snap on dealer I guess you return it twenty five dollars half inch drive uh, a half inch Walden this is six dollars and fifty cents a ratcheting uh, tap handle is ten dollars a whole bunch of craftsman wrenches here which apparently I didn't put the price on those either all right we're having a hell of a day so uh, some of those are metric some of those are standard and uh, I'm sure there's a bunch of stuff I forgot this is short and sweet obviously I uh, hope everyone had a good fourth and we shall see you soon thanks